channel here at Mimi's Prepping Kitchen. Boy, the price of meat sure has went up, hasn't it? Um, for me, you know, I have to uh, really watch what I'm buying and try to find some deals at Walmart. I try to find, you know, the yellow stickers and, um, you know, I haven't had a whole lot of luck. I have found some, um, but yeah. Watching deals is just like something we almost have to do anymore. Um, so today I'm not going into Walmart. Uh, I've been in there not really finding what I want, but I happened to pick up um, the flyer and see what they had at um, a supermarket where I live. And uh, I don't know how many of you have these stores in your area but uh, they are called Family Fair. Now they have these supermarkets I know in Michigan, Wisconsin, and Minnesota. I don't know if they have them in any other states. Uh, let me know if you have them where you live. Now they are a little bit pricier on quite a few of their things and that's normally why I don't go in there. <laughs> um, but they did have, uh, let me see if I can get this where you can see it, spare ribs, let me see, right here I think it is, let me find it, I'll put my finger on it, right here, okay, buy one, get one free. So, um, I am going to go in there and check up on some of these buy one get one free spare ribs. They're country country ribs, and uh, so I'm going to go in and check out what they have and uh, check out their shelves and see how they look as well and some of their prices. But definitely the country ribs. So I'll meet you inside. Thank you so much for joining. Hit that like and subscribe and. Uh, Let's get in the family fair. It's two ninety nine for Idaho potatoes. Six ninety nine over here for the Yukon gold potatoes and red potatoes. Six ninety nine also. They are looking really good on their produce today here at Family Fair in Northern Michigan. And they actually are pretty stocked up. They are a little bit pricier than going to Walmart, and that's why I don't go here too often. But uh, they are very well stocked up today. Three peppers, three for five. Let's go over here and look at the what they have. Two for seven. All that, but pretty good stocked up here at the family fair today. Sixty-nine cents for green cabbage and lettuce. It looks like it is. $3.99, oh, $2.49 for the head of lettuce. Bananas are $0.69 cents a pound. That seems kind of high. Tomatoes are $2.29 a pound. They have quite a bit of tomatoes here uh, for $2.99 a pound. <laughs> and they also had quite a few of the onions for three, or no, they're on sale for $2.49. They have what they call a yes card that will take the price down. The onions are looking pretty good today. Over here they have corned beef, $5.99 a pound. Save a dollar a pound. Ground beef, $5.49 a pound over here. Um, like I say, they're quite a bit higher, but I come over here today. Now you can get that buy one, get one free. And that is going to be on pork, on pork that is seasoned. Um, but looky there. They have for $2.94 a pound, buy one, get one free on uh, the spare ribs, so that's a very good deal. And uh, they have $2.49 on the roast a pound, so yeah, we are here on those days. $3.29 on the chicken breast, but they are looking very well sucked on the chicken, so that's good. Quite a bit on the spices, but I definitely can get those cheaper at Walmart or Dollar Tree, which is right next door. So, um, yeah, like I say, a lot of things you don't get here. 
Uh, they do have nominal powdered sugar, 419, and I'm not seeing very much powdered sugar. They have those up there, which are pretty small, and uh, a couple back here, 419 a pound, and that's all they have for sugar down there, 369 on the dominoes, but not a whole lot of sugar here today. Um, they have Pioneer 339, and they got some down there of uh, the brand, store brand for 269. But not a whole lot of sugar, definitely not a whole lot of sugar. Oils uh, 649, 489, and they don't have a whole lot here. Crisco 999 for Crisco. Out. And the store brand is 719. Not a whole lot here, but they do have some at a very high price. Flour's not looking too bad. 529, that is a pretty hefty price on flour. Um, but they do have quite a bit here. A lot of people come to Family Fair because, well, it's smaller and you don't have to deal with Walmart. Over here in Laundry Soap, $14.99 for the Tide, $20.99. Yeah, that seems pretty expensive for laundry soap. Um, like I say, <laughs> some people come here that can afford it, but um, other people just go next door to Walmart. Three ninety nine for a small arm and hammer. And that uh, that laundry soap, but wow, the price, right? Price is definitely here's the cheaper one, four ninety nine. Still not very cheap for the, our family. Hey, they do have some jars over here. Um, $13.99. That's half pint though. $13.99. Uh, and I'm not seeing any of uh, the pints. They do have these big boys. That's $17.99. All off. <laughs> Toilet paper is getting to be a little sparse. $4.99 for 12 pack. Not too, too bad. 919 for the scat tissue, but you never really see some empty spots on the toilet paper. Uh, Continental for 2093 on sale. $1.89 for the uh, napkins. And 409 for this TP here. Cut Toma? Never heard of it. Okay. <laughs> but uh, yeah, you can see they are having. A little bit of a problem. 579 for that smart bath tissue. And over here to the um, bread, $1.59 a loaf. But those are missing off there. But they do have more bread down here at $2.59 a loaf. That's kind of pricey. And down here they have more bread. But kind of pricey. <laughs> Always go after the cheap brands, guys. Uh, let me know in the comments if you go after the cheap brands too. And jelly is uh, kind of sparse. They have jelly. $5.39, $4.99 for those. Um, and they do have some gels of peanut butter here. And it's not real stocked, but it is stocked. 100% mm. peanuts. How about that? $3.89. And 239 it looks like for our family brand. And, uh, but that is kind of bare there. And over here to the canned dog food. Yeah, that's looking pretty bare. They do have some over here. $3.99 for that. Yeah, that's quite pricey for sure. $1.79 for the pedigree. And uh, that's $2.69. So pretty pricey on the dog food for sure. So, anyway, guys. I am going to head out of here. Um, there's some empty shelves of dog food up there. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video of me at the Family Fair. I am normally at Walmart today. I pick Family Fair because I don't get in here very often. Cat foods are looking pretty well stocked. But boy, have they got it. Spends a little tiny fancy piece of dollar thirty-nine. So anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, Make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. To live, God bless.